friends you can see that i'm using fide os 18 on my pc and if you want to install fide os 18 on your pc you will have to watch this video till the end and if you want to know what's the feature of fide os 18 you can follow this video i have already made a video about fide os 18 so friends first of all just right click on taskbar and select task manager click on more details go to performance and here you will have to select cpu and here you will find the cpu generation in my case it is 6100t that means it's sixth generation cpu i'm using intel sixth generation cpu you'll have to note down the generation and then just go to any browser and search for pied os open the very first link here you'll find the download option just click on the download option and here you'll have to select pied os for pc if you're using intel processor from third gen to seventh gen you'll have to download from here and if you're using intel processor from eighth gen to thirteenth gen you'll have to download from here if you're using intel pentium processor with either intel hd or intel iris x graphics you will also have to download from here and the last option is for amd basically if you are using amd processor with integrated graphics card you can download from here and if you are using amd radeon graphics card you can also download from here and just click on any link and here you'll find three options official download mirror one that is iCloud and mirror two that is google drive always try to download from official download and if you want to know what's new in fire 18 there is a video on my channel you can also follow this video after downloading fire os you'll have to search for repose and from here click on download and click on the latest after downloading just close the browser and now you will have to right click on the start menu and go to disk management here you will have to remind that you will have to create a free space of minimum 32 gigs so just right click on any bigger drive and click on shrink volume just put the size as 32 GB or bigger then click on shrink an allocated space has been created just right click on the an allocated space select a new simple volume click on next click on next click on next and put the name of the drive and now put the name of the drive as pied os just click on next and finish one thing you will have to keep in mind that the drive name is pied os and it will help during the installation process okay now just close it now just open the file explorer go to download folder and here you'll find the repose and pied os just open repose click on yes again yes and from this screen and here you will have to insert a pen drop and remember 8 gb to your computer and just select the file os file and drag and drop it to this repose application it will automatically populate but before starting the process if you just click on start every data on your pen drive will be erased so it's recommended to take a backup before doing this process just click on start click on ok the process is started it will take 10 to 15 minutes you'll have to wait here So when it's completed it will show it's ready and you'll have to close it now you'll have to restore your pc and access the bios menu of your pc to access the bios menu of your pc you can refer this portal otherwise you can search on google
in bias menu you'll have to go to security and select the secure boot and if your secure boot is enabled make sure your secure boot is disabled and now hit obtain and again hit on enter to access the boot menu of your pc you can refer this photo otherwise you can search on google from the boot menu just select your usb and hit enter Now in the screen select your region and keyboard language then click on OK. And in this page click on get started and now you will at in the screen you'll have to select try it first. Don't click on install firewalls. If you click on here install firewalls you will Enter hard drive will be erased and only firewalls will be there. Just click on try first. Click on next. Just wait a few seconds. Now here accept terms and conditions. Again accept terms and conditions. And here you'll have to select Google account and click on next. Select personal use. Click on next. Again click on next. Now here you will have to log in with your Gmail ID. Now in the screen just click on next. Again select your theme and click on next. Just uncheck this and click on get started okay it's done now you will have to click here go to store and here you will find installer if you're unable to find the installer on here you can search over here just open the installer click on add click on add app you will have to wait here till stand on it. Okay, it's downloaded. Just click on open. And here you'll have to select a multi boot installation. And here just select your partition. Here in my case, my hard drive is NVMe drive. SG is my pen drive where I'm installing. SD is my pen drive and NVMe 0 and 1 is my SSD. Just select your drive and here you will have to and here you will have to select the partition where you want to install Fedwise. It is a 34 gigabyte we have created. Just select the drive and just click on here and select your drive which we have already created in my case it's 34 gb and in your case it may be 34 gb 64 gb whatever you have created before just select it and here you'll have to select the efi just select your nvme and here it is automatically selected just click on next and just click on install Click on OK and the installation has been started. You will have to wait here. OK, the installation is completed. Now you will have to sit down your PC and restart again. Now this time in your PC you can see a dual board screen. It is Windows and this is for FireOS. Just select your FireOS and hit enter. And in the screen you 
now just click on ok again get started now you can remove your open drive from your computer again accept terms and conditions and again select your google account you can also use local account just click on next and select for personal use again next again next just again login with your google account Just click on next. Again, select your theme and click on next. And check this. Get started. Congratulations! Fidewars has been successfully installed on your PC Dualboot.